Welcome! In front of me I have Xiaomi SmartBand active and I'm gonna show you how to pair this SmartBand with the Android phone. First thing you will need to do is to turn on your SmartBand and you can turn it on by plugging it to a charger. Basically you will need to have a charging cable that was provided with your SmartBand and it looks like this. We have the USB end and the 2 pin end you can uh, plug to your smart band and once you plug it to the uh, charger or the computer and then plug the other end with two pins to your smart band it will receive power and it will turn on automatically and after it turns on you probably will see the list of languages on the screen you can scroll through this list uh, find the language you would like to use on your smart band and once you find it you can tap on it to select it and now as you can see we have the QR code on the screen which means we need to download and install the a Mi Fitness application. To do that, go to the phone you want to pair your smart band with, make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, open the Play Store. In the Play Store, tap on Search, then tap on the search bar and type in Mi Fitness and tap on Search. And you should see this application on the list, Mi Fitness, formerly known as Xiaomi Wear. Tap on the Install button. And once the application is done installing, you can tap on Open to open it. Here tap on Start. Uh, check the first box, you, box rather. You can also check the second one if you like to. I'm just gonna sec select the or check the first one and tap on Agree. Now we need to select a region, so tap right here. Scroll through the list, find the region you want to use and tap on it, and tap on Next. And after that, you should see the health page of the app. Now tap on Device and here tap on add device, tap on agree, tap on agree, allow the required permission and the app will start searching for nearby devices, it should detect your Xiaomi Band 9 active. Tap on it to select it and as you can see we need to log in into Xiaomi account, so tap on sign in, it will direct you to this page and here you need to enter the email address and the password to log in and uh, you can also create a new account if you don't have one or you can use the uh, phone number and login via the SMS. And there's also the Google account option if you want to use the third party account. I already have an account, so I'm gonna enter the email password and address, or rather email password, <laughs> email password, email address and password, my bad. Okay, and tap on sign in. And after you, you log in, it will direct you back to the ad page you should see your Xiaomi Band 9 on the list. Tap on it to select it. In the app, tap on continue. On the band, tap on the check mark to confirm. Here uh, you can tap on done, continue. Next, next, done. And right here we can turn on the phone notifications. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your smart bed. And we have two options, mirror phone notifications and customize notifications. If you select mirror phone notifications, it will basically copy the notification settings from your phone. And this option allows you to customize them to your liking. Uh, if you want to allow the permissions and enable the notifications for your smart bed, you need to tap on, select one of the options and tap on set then allow the required permissions. If you don't care and you want the notifications to be disabled, tap on dismiss. I will enable them, so I'm gonna select customize, tap on set. On this page we need to tap on set. It will direct us to the device and app notifications. Here we need to find the Xiaomi, or rather Mi Fitness application. It should be somewhere on the list. Here it is. And once you find it, you need to tap on it. Tap on the switch next to allow notification access to enable it, tap on allow, and once you enable uh, uh, allow notification access, you can go back and in the app you should see the uh, page called app notifications if you select the uh, customize option. If you didn't, if you select the mirror the phone, you won't see this, see this page, but if you selected customize, it will open this page and here you can enable and disable the notifications for specific uh, applications. And how it works is basically if you enable the notifications, let's say for Discord, and you receive the notification from Discord on your phone, that notification will be forwarded to your smart band. But if you disable it, 
it won't be forwarded to your smartband so you will see it only on your phone okay i'm gonna turn it on for discord and then tap on done next we have the notifications for the incoming calls if you want to receive the notifications about the incoming calls so basically uh, smartband will vibrate display the number or the contact uh, name and uh, you need to check this box and tap on set uh, if you don't care and if you don't want to use this feature, tap on dismiss to keep it disabled. I'm gonna enable it, allow the required permissions of course, like this. And next we have the sync DND with phone. So basically sync the do not disturb mode with a phone. So uh, how it works is basically if you turn on the do not disturb mode on your phone, it will turn on your smart, on your smart band. Uh, same for the turning it off, so if you turn it off on your phone, it will turn off on the smartband, and I believe it also works the other way around. So if you enable it on your smartband, it will also turn on on your phone, and also it will turn off if you turn it off. I believe that's how it works. You can dismiss it if you don't want to use this feature, or tap on set if you want to enable it. And then you can tap on uh, got it. Oh, never mind, we have a couple more uh, pop-ups. First one is about the sync so if you want to sync the fitness data from previous devices if you had any devices connected to your account you can tap ok and it will sync the info if you don't care you can tap on cancel then we can tap on got it and here we have the device page on it we have our xiaomi smartband 9 active and if you wake up the screen on your smartband you should see the watch face which means the devices are paired together and that's how you pair this uh, smartband with the android phone Thank you for watching, if you found this video helpful please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.